listen, this is a new idea. It's a real idea here. I'm not like spouting some philosophical bullshit. So listen, because you're not going to. You're not going to watch it. I'm being supervised by some dumbasses that think they're God. Okay, here we go. See my face right here? You see this? There's electrical points all over my face. And that phone that I'm using can actually put out a light from the front of it that will measure my face for the electrical impulses to know if I'm about to blink or smile or whatnot. We could create an app for the world that every time you pick up your phone, it takes a picture of your face in the app only to monitor your electrical stability based on a grid that goes here to 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 here. That way, you know if the person's happy or sad. And every time they open up an app, okay, so say you want this app for your child. Your eight-year-old's talking about suicide. Your eight-year-old just walked in front of the bus. He wants to die. You don't want him to die. He's seeing stuff online. You don't like it. You put the app on. It checks his face in the morning. It measures his electrical activity. It says, you know, he just went to a site that it's talking about how to swallow Drano. And he's going to another TikTok site where people are doing Drano things. And you get warned immediately. And it shows that at that time he's angry. His electrical impulse on his face is angry and he's sad. And now he's watching videos. And then the app notifies you that your child is imbalanced. And then if you're actually something like a court ordered person that has to have a psychological therapy, or you have a psychological problem, or you have PTSD, or you have ups and downs, or maybe permanent lows, or you're on federal violation, this program should be used on that too. So every day you check in for your parole officer, it measures your face, it measures what you do, and it lets them know if you're thinking about criminal activity, buying a gun, making a bomb, the idea that human beings are going to get any better at regulating each other is ridiculous. It's time to use artificial intelligence. Our government entities have acted like God for way too long. We can make sure that human beings are safe by monitoring each other through ethical measures. Nobody was in trouble there. All we were looking for is the child that wanted to harm itself, or the man who had gotten out of prison that felt desperate because he had nothing. So he got a gun and he walked into a grocery store and he shot somebody who was a young father who has three children and his wife just got breast cancer and they're about to lose their house. But only the rich people never have to worry about that. The rest of us that are put into the huddled masses inside the building and have no classes, we have to be there. It's critical for us to think about this. It's a theoretical construct. Do we actually care? Or do we want to continue to be subdivided by an ubermensch idea of capitalism that only murders people when they don't follow your way or locks you up when they don't like your color? Let's change our world. Let's care more by doing better. This is a real thing, and you won't even watch it. And I condemn you for that.